first time in decades, Woody Allen's wife is speaking publicly about the scandals surrounding her family. Soon Yi Previn calls the sexual misconduct allegations against her husband unjust and accuses her adoptive mother, Mia Farrow, of taking advantage of the Me Too movement. <laughs> Soon Yi Previn spoke with New York Magazine in an article published last night. Previn, who is famously private, says the reason she wanted to speak out now is because accusations that Allen had sexually abused Dylan Farrow when she was a child had resurfaced. Dylan Farrow is Previn's adopted sister. Both were adopted by the actress Mia Farrow. Previn first met Allen when she was 11 when the director began dating Mia Farrow. Their headline making romantic relationship began when Previn was 21, while Alan was still in a relationship with her mother. In the interview, Previn opens up about her childhood as Pharaoh's daughter, saying it was not a happy one and claiming that Pharaoh was physically abusive and neglectful. But one of the most bombshell claims Previn makes to the magazine is that Pharaoh has been taking advantage of the hashtag MeToo movement to spread lies about Alan and to, quote, parade Dylan as a victim, end quote, so that a whole new generation is hearing about the scandal. The accusations that Alan sexually abused Dylan Farrow date back to 1992 when she was seven years old. Alan has always denied the allegations, but as the current conversation about sexual harassment in Hollywood brought the story back into the headlines over the past year, many actors have distanced themselves from Alan and apologized for taking roles in his films. Dylan Farrow has since responded to Previn's claims in the article, releasing a statement on Twitter saying in part, no one is parading me around as a victim. I continue to be an adult woman making a credible allegation. Her brother, the journalist Ronan Farrow, who won the Pulitzer Prize for an expose of Harvey Weinstein that helped kick off the hashtag MeToo movement, also slammed the article, taking issue with the fact that it was written by a longtime friend of Woody Allen. For City News, I'm Terry Hart.